Now, in this video, I want to discuss to you guys about some common thing that people does but doesn't really know how to explain why, okay? And that's called the standard diet, all right? Now, first and foremost, I want to explain what do I mean by the standard diet, okay? So, standard diet are the kind of food habits, food choices that people eat on a day-to-day -day basis, like regularly for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and any kind of snacks in between, all right? Let's take for an example, subject A. So A wakes up in the morning and have breakfast, maybe those um, flour and rich kind of bread or noodles or rice, and then have some bit of a eggs or maybe chicken and some sauces. What A doesn't realize is that the kind of food that he chose for the breakfast are what I call refined carbohydrates and sugar. So what happened is A would feel like he is well fed, depending on the amounts that he ate. And then two hours later, he would feel or experience a fluctuation in energy level. He might feel a little bit sleepy and also feel the need to take a nap. So A would start eating a mid-morning snack okay to bring his energy level back up how many of you have actually experienced the need to take a nap after a lunch the explanation for that is actually because you were eating so much of these refined carbohydrates which gets turned into glucose inside your body so rapidly and that explains why after eating you felt a increase in energy levels but instead you felt a dip of energy an hour or two later and then you felt the need to take a nap okay so what happened and what's going on over there is a condition what we call hypoglycemia so insulin is the hormone that is responsible to balance your glucose or take glucose out of your blood the nature of homeostasis it means our body in equilibrium will only have one teaspoon of sugar for the whole of your blood at any given time. So insulin is responsible to bring your blood glucose level down if it has too much, i.e. eating too much refined carbohydrates or sugar, which most definitely convert into sugar inside your blood and it will go beyond what your homeostasis requires, all right? That process of the insulin action actually drove down your blood glucose level and that makes you feel less energetic, all right? So what happened is your body will stimulate you to grab some more glucose, okay? So the point here is, do you guys see that vicious cycle? And what I just described to you guys about the blood glucose, insulin action, everything that you eat on a standard diet triggers that. Everything that you eat on a standard diet like A here influences that. And that is the reason why you feel that energy yo-yo, okay? That roller coaster of energy up, energy down, and then the cycle just go on and on for many, many years in your life. If you know anyone who's doing a low carb nutrition lifestyle, you'll never see them going through that same vicious cycle. Reason being because they're always fasting, which regulates your blood glucose level really, really well because you are always at that optimal level. You'll never experience energy dip or energy spikes like a yo-yo effect. And also because most of their foods are very, very low in carbs. They don't stimulate a lot of insulin action. Whenever insulin is present inside your blood, fat burning stops. Insulin stimulates storage, fat burning stops. When there is no insulin, other hormones come into play like your glucagon, um, HGH, which is your human growth hormone, etc., etc., which stimulates fat burning, um, fat breakdown from your adipose tissue to be used for energy. Okay, but that's a complex topic for another day. So I'm going to end this video. I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say from the beginning. If you don't, go back, listen to it again.
to find out what is low carb contact us all right follow us on that instagram low carb nation brunei sign up for what's about to happen there will be a nutritional program low carb nutrition program which will teach you all the tips and the hacks to achieve homeostasis in a healthy way i'll talk to you guys again in some of the videos some of the day bye bye